<laughs> Told you guys I'd probably be going live again. This deck here behind me, this is in Hebron, Kentucky. And I have zero doubts that we saved this family from replacing um, the floor of this deck. Um, and probably a lot more, okay? This deck here, I'll post pictures later. It was extremely weathered. Uh, the boards on it, uh, you could say the floorboards on this deck here were extremely sun and weather damaged. They were fibrous, gray wood, and we've come in, they had big chunks missing out of them. We've come in with the silverback epoxy, all that, repaired a bunch of boards, replaced a, replaced a bunch of boards, new lattice system all the way around and then came in and encapsulated and armored this thing let's take a look so here's the new lattice system that we put in all the way around here this is a wood lattice system very very beautiful turned out great this was all rugged hanging missing um, and it wasn't trimmed out, so it didn't have these trim boards around it. It was just generic lattice that was stapled up there. We come in. Um, she showed me a picture of a deck that had lattice system, and it was trimmed out. Keep in mind, the deck picture that she showed me was of a deck that was probably, uh, you know, three to four times more expensive than this deck. A higher quality deck. But still, I wanted to give her what she wanted. So we came in put lattice in and then we trimmed it out with one by fours all the way around in the back side too everywhere this is a little little tiny deck this deck is very very tiny um, so new lattice system a lot of guys will make the mistake here and lay this and lay this trim board flush they'll they'll lay it flush with the with the concrete the problem that happens there is water starts to gather and it'll start to rot it'll start to rot that trim and that lattice so you got to keep it up off the concrete a couple inches that's a rookie mistake a lot of guys will make that with lattice you can't do it you got to keep this trim board up about an inch or so up off that concrete especially in a pool area like this where there's a lot of water constantly coming and going you want that to be able to f flow freely okay a lot of guys will make that mistake don't make that mistake we come in armored all this railing this was all you can see here this was all crazy extremely weathered wood these are repairs that were made today you can kind of see them flashing a little bit they'll go away once the epoxy and stuff completely cures up okay but this this floor was completely weather damaged sun damaged it's amazing let me just tell you you see that you see yeah, I'll point that out in a second. But this was completely uh, full-blown. Any other person would have said, hey, we're not doing it unless you replace every deck board. Okay? I've come in here. We've saved. We've saved her the expense of replacing this floor. Okay? We've armored these to the teeth. This is, in order to do this deck, in order... To save these deck, these floorboards here, I went ahead and ate um, the material cost. This is around, uh, I think, 10 coatings of elastomer to save these boards. Um, I'm going to be honest with you. We didn't, uh, we produced this deck at cost, okay? It happens, okay? Boy, look at that pretty, look at that pretty thick build, bud. It happens occasionally. Occasionally I get one that I end up having to produce at cost. We lose out. This took way more to fill this out than was anticipated. Um, in fact, I'm over on budget on this deck. I lost money on this deck. But that's okay. Um, she, um, Her family has bought decks from me. And I wanted to do this for her. Very happy to do it. Very, very beautiful deck. It turned out, turned out well. Um all the cracks we had big large cracks running down through this board they're all filled in the armor's nice and thick this was an extremely weathered board look at the splinter lock technology here 
you guys can see the splinter lock technology at work here okay anybody else would have come down through here ran their fingers through here we'd be getting splinters from this this was all loose and frayed and open now little babies can come down through here rub their hands down through here they're not going to get a splinter okay that splinter lock technology from us is awesome all this is all locked down very very well with elastomer this is flashing right now it'll stop flashing it just needs a little bit of time to cure up all the rails are done everything's done pretty little deck let's go back almost made the mistake of walking in the pool last time i was here let me make that mistake again we'll look at it from afar imagine the most tore down deck weather damaged horrible looking deal that you can imagine for a deck we've pulled it together we've saved it she doesn't have to tear down and start over saved this family thousands saved them thousands there's no doubt um, it's crazy boy it's stick build look at this stick build man look at this look at this stick build armor through here splinter lock technology no splinters no splinters 100% cop it rub my hands down through there babies can run their hands down through there it boy without without this armor on here if you would have went and done that boy you'd have been in trouble bud you'd have been in trouble you'd have been in trouble look i have zero doubts that i saved saved them massively from replacement because they were there they were going to have to do it it was either me because it, it, the reality of it is there ain't anybody else in the area competent enough to do it that's just the truth and i hate to tell i hate to put it to you guys like that but if there is i ain't found them i ain't found them and i've been trying desperately begging it's either me or replacement that that was their choice they chose me i'm happy they did we got the deck armored we replaced what we needed to replace washed it really well took care of the fasteners the loose fasteners stuff like that on it and they're good to go they're set up for the summer they can enjoy the summer swim they got splinter lock technology uh they're not gonna have to worry about splinters in their hands and feet and all that stuff and it's a it's a pretty little deal here in hebron www.kongarmor.com i've got deck projects going across the tri-state right now i'm turning decks um we're we're taking old worn down beaten down decks families that are facing huge expenses for replacement we're taking and we're saving them that expense um which is a beautiful thing it's it's a great thing when you can offer somebody a solution that isn't their entire savings and they get to keep a little bit it makes them it makes them feel good and it makes you feel good you know all right stand by for the next transformation because we got a lot more coming i'm anthony ford i am the nation's best painting deck painting contractor right now www.kongarmor.com click on book free quote i'll come out and see you bye